Good morning everyone. As you can see, we got a little bit of snow last night. Evidently the storm tracked further north because we didn't get much. Today I'm sure I'll be picking up more tree limbs that fall. It's supposed to be pretty windy all weekend. Today's plans are to get this shed cleaned out and possibly get it ready to move. Not sure where I'm going to move it at right now, but I want to move it somewhere to store feed for the chickens and the turkeys and that that we're going to be getting. do a little bit of repairs on the front door and get it cleaned out before I move it. It does look like it's sunk down in the dirt a little bit so I guess we'll see what kind of shape it's in once we get it up out of there. Like I said earlier we did get a little bit of snow last night not much getting dark enough out that the light come back on. It was out just 10 minutes ago. As you can see though, it does look like we have a storm getting ready to roll through. Okay, it is time to check on our sprouts. First we will do the mung beans. them off with filtered water. Swish them around. And drain them off. Shake them to get most of that water out of there. I'm going to take the lid off and kind of give you a view of what's going on in there. They are sprouting. Starting to look pretty good. So now I like to get them so they're laying in there like that. You don't want them like that to stop the airflow. About like that, put them back in a bowl. Next we will do alfalfa. There is a view of what it looks like right now. We'll fill this up with water. Now I just kind of bang it on the sink, get all that water out of there. You do this every 12 hours. Rinse and drain. Anywhere from four to seven days you will have sprouts for salads. It's drained off good enough. So now when you put this in here, if you look right there where that little rectangle is, that will let it go all the way down. 
if you turn it just a little bit, that leaves that up off the bottom. I don't think you guys can see it from there, so I will bring it over here. This little lip that's right here, if you put it right there on that rectangle, that'll drop all the way down in. You raise it up and turn it just a little bit, it holds it up off the bottom. That is where we put them as they're sprouting. Or that first one was uh, broccoli and friends. This here is alfalfa. The alfalfa is always ahead of the broccoli and friends. Swish it around a little bit. Dump the water in there. You can tilt it like that and a lot of the water will drain off, but I like to bang it and swish it around a little bit. Good enough. I will put the lids on these right side up now. Later today or probably tomorrow morning we'll take the lids off of those and leave them off because we want them to start greening up. This here is wheatgrass for blueberry or cat. Fill it up and let it drain through. As you can see, the bottom of that has holes in it so it drains through. So if you have more trays, you just water the top and let it drain down through. But that's about all she wrote for taking care of your sprouts every day. And we just leave them set here on the counter. <laughs>